the sea lions are benthic, so they're constantly diving down to the bottom and spending as long as they can down there. So yeah, the idea was essentially to take the video we have from the sea lions and identify and map those habitats. Um, usually this work's done with really specialized boats and, and cameras and that gear is really expensive. The vessels are expensive. You need a really specialized crew to operate all the gear. The advantage with having sea lions collect the data for you is that they're really efficient. They cover huge areas of the seabed. We originally have to capture the animal, so um, they get sedated for about an hour. We, uh, we put the cameras on and then um, the animal will eventually go to sea and then when they return um, to nurse their pup, yeah, we can recover the gear. We had no idea about what sort of habitats really were down there, especially for the deep areas. So getting this footage of these, you know, beautiful reefs, caves and canyons that the, the sea lions are swimming through and using, that was quite amazing. That was the first footage we had of, um, yeah, the mother taking a pup to sea and the mother's, um, yeah, she catches a cuttlefish with the, um, with the pup right there and they're tearing it apart and the mothers in particular, you know, trying to, um, you know, keep their pups fat and healthy. It's one of the key next steps is how you can value different areas and habitats for sea lions, which is a really key question for us because the species is endangered and their populations have declined by um, 60% over the last 40 years. And there's so many different things you can do and now with, with technology and with these machine learning models. And this is really, um, I guess, the beginning and we're kind of, I think, just scratching the surface.